Today we are looking at base 85 Haji, medium low, left footed, 4 star, 4 star. Can play just cam in other positions. In terms of the actual card, looks like a really good rounded card as again. Just his finishing is a little bit lacking, but acceleration, sprint speed, really good. Agility and balance, especially for somebody that is 5 foot 8, it's going to feel really good on left stick dribbling. Composure is good. His passing is amazing for an 85. His stamina is also very good. But it's just his finishing that we're lacking. Obviously, I wanted to boost up his pace because we are going to have a hunter on him and his obviously his finishing as well. In terms of traits, we don't have anything crazy there. Unfortunately, just flair and everything else is CPU. We are going to jump into gameplay. I do play a 4-1-2-1-2 brackets too. So if you've not seen or how know how that works, I've done a full breakdown on my channel, the formations. That being said, let's go jump into gameplay. If you don't care about gameplay, I will be on footbin at the end talking about chem styles, his pricing, his best positions, and much more. If not, let's go jump into gameplay, but have a word from our sponsor first. Are you tired of playing sweat teams like this? Make sure you go to Alt Knight, select foot, select foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy, select your payment method, and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. Let's have a look at our opponent's team for today. He's got himself a nice La Liga, or just a full Spanish team, which is very nice. With Haji, we're just going to be testing how he feels as a cam compared to last year and other things. Most important for me is his link-up play and finishing. He's got very good net dribbling as well for that height, as I mentioned, with his high agility. Nice pass. Trying to find Benzema. Played it through. Oh, very unlucky. Good start, though, from him. Off. Back to Haji. Haji going to take a quick shot. Oh, good save. Let's see if we can score this. Full power. Oh, so close. So, so close. Oh, I try to ball roll around. He feels very good at dribbling. In terms of moving the ball forward, quite good at passing as well. It's just his left stick dribbling is so good, especially because of his height and his agility and balance. We find there, gets past one. Gets past two, kind of. Not quite, but he does get the loose ball. As you're using that strength just to hold off. Gets away from the tackle. He's so good at doing that little step over move. Holding it up, little layoff. Back to Haji. Gonna shoot across. And we've got the goal with him there. Lovely one, two. Really, really good linking up there. Gets the goal as well. I do find he's quite responsive unless it dribbling. Just trying to get used to his body type ever so slightly. As our opponent does at Rage Quick, see if we get ourselves a goal. Let's have a look at his possession. So we had nine dribbles, seven complete. Just trying to learn him. He's very, very quick in terms of doing stuff like that. Shooting, one blocked, and then obviously one goal. So good shooting, and his passing is the most impressive. We tried to get the old direct corner in, nearly got it, but quite missed. But no other completed, no other intercepted passes or anything. Everything else completed. So let's go jump into another game. So let's have a look at the second team then. So it is going to be a better team this time. That is a much better team. Hopefully, Hadji can still unlock the door like he did in the last game. But so far, impressive him to do intercept. Can he get on the end of it? He can't, unfortunately. All right, fine, Hadji. Over the top to Benzema. He's got a header it. Over the keeper. And we got ourselves an assist nice and early there with Hadji. He's really good as a cam. Plays exactly how we did last year. Just a really nice card. He's always a good price as well at FIFA, especially if he ever gets an SBC or is in swaps or anything like that. He's not great at defending, I have to say. Obviously, he's a cam, so you don't expect him, but he seems to, like, every time he puts a foot in, he doesn't get away with the ball, which is a bit annoying at times. But this left it dribbling here, very good. Lays it off. Calm, cool, collective. Back to him. Little turn, right foot. He's so good at those little intricate passes. All right, Hadji here. Phantom glides past one. Finds the space on the next. Gets fouled, unfortunately, or tackled. Right, let's see what Hadji's stats are saying. So he's got really good free kick stats. Unfortunately, I'm not the best at free kicks. So I'm going to let him run over it and then play it in. Waiting for the hold up. Gets past one with a skill. Oh, I couldn't quite find Benzema, but he did get the ball back with a great tackle. Again, very unlucky there. How's that not a foul ref? Right, let's go Hadji into Park. Park finds Hadji. Oh, I should have just shot then. I wanted to get on the left-hand side. I forgot he's got four-star weak for That's poor for me. Great run, though. Right, here we go. Hadji driving through. Left to dribble. Finds Benzema. Snapshot. Good save. Another great pass. Let's see if we can do the same trick as the last game. He brings his keeper out. Waiting for the opportunity to get past. 
Find the space. Best time shot. Finesse. That's a poor shot. That's a poor shot. That's what happens if you don't have finesse shot trait. Adji's through. Right foot. Cross goal. Bang. There is another goal from him. What a goal. We have gritted on him because he gritty to us. You don't gritty and don't get it back. What a lovely goal from Hadji there. Right foot. That's what I should have done the first opportunity that I missed. Bit of left to dribble in. Lays it across. And there is a lovely assist there from Hadji. Gets his way through the left stick dribble in. Manages to get a goal. That is half time. Hadji with a goal and an assist or two goals and an assist. Pretty good game. This guy is playing very, very defensive and very, very sweaty. But we are managing to find a way through. A couple of things I'm noticing is he's a very lacking in physicality, Hadji. If anybody gets too close to him or puts a little bit of pressure on him, he's okay. But as soon as they lean into him, he seems to lose the ball, forget where the ball was. Hadji, right foot, left foot. Go on, what a goal. Have we got what foot he was for a second then? There's a left foot finesse from Hadji. Attacks left. Hadji, what a ball. Absolutely unlocked the door. Benzema, what a save to Hadji. He's decided not to shoot. I don't know what's just happened there. How's Benzema not finished that chance for us? But what a pass from Hadji, though. Hadji, good ball through to Park. Hadji outside. Good save again from the goalkeeper. For Hadji. Hadji, this could be the winner. He's got the winner, Hadji. <laughs> What a goal. He's so clinical up front. Inside the box, he's really good. Outside the box, not so great. Link-up play, amazing. Lestic dribbling, also very good. He's only a cam. He can definitely not play in the other position, that is for sure. But what a goal that is to possibly win us a game unless something happens here, which it doesn't. We see the game out. One more attack, maybe. Find Benzema. Keepers out. And we got ourselves this assist right at the end because the goalkeeper came out. And that's why you don't do toxic celebrations, ladies and gentlemen, because you will get karma. But what a game from Hadji there. He's trying to race quit as well. He's had enough. Let's go and jump on to Footbin. So he's coming in about 188000 So I reckon around 160 is a really good price from him. We had Hunter on him, and basically that's just to make him into the best possible cam he can be. I think that is the best cam style for him. If you wanted to put a shadow on, what a lot of people are suggested as well, it honestly depends what you want to do. That's more box to box, but it does depend. So we have put a shadow on him, and it, yeah, I think I personally think that Hunter is the one to go for. If you want to make him really attacking, get that pace up, get the shooting up, put a Hunter on him, and really can play. It becomes an 86 cam. This card is again really consistent, really good. Not the best for shooting outside the box, I have to say, but inside very clinical. If we had finesse shot trait or some better traits like that, we could have ourselves a serious card. But in terms of traits, again, just to recap, he only has chip shot, playmaker, long shot taker, and flair. And half of them are actually with a computer. Not something you can do yourself. But linking up, really good. You don't really notice his right foot that much in terms of being a problem. And just a really consistent card overall. As always, if you have any questions about this card or any other card in the game, please comment down below. If you are new to the channel, consider hitting that like button, subscribing, and I'll catch you in the next one. See you.